Hey guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'll show you how to send emails from contact form or any other form without writing any server side code. Okay, let me show you. Here I have a basic sample, a basic contact form. Let me show you the working of this. Name, let me give it as name Manju and the email as manju at gmail.com and message as YouTube video. And let me submit this. You can see successfully submitted and let me go to my gmail and refresh it yeah you can see i got a new message new message from manju from manju email and the message as youtube video okay for this we have a service called email js they'll provide you a service to send emails without writing any server side code okay just go to service uh, email emailjs.com yeah let me show you how it works this is a website just go to docs and scroll down you can see the examples react view angular wix click on the react here we have they already provided a basic code just copy that code with a basic form i already created a new a basic react app and also the file called contact.jsx and let me paste the code here and save it okay you can see we here we have a basic form with label name email message okay let me show you how it looks let me refresh it okay we should call this contact in the app okay contact okay okay you can see here the function name is contact us let me make it as contact okay you got name email message okay you can see here we are use importing email js before importing that we should install that dependency because i already installed that dependency that's why i'm not getting any error just you write your npm i at email js slash browser okay just click enter it will download the dependency yeah, meanwhile, I'll, sh I'll explain this code. Here we have a basic form with label name, mail, message. And on submit, we are calling this send email function. You can see here send email function. This is the built in function, or this is the function which emailjs is providing emailjs.send form, your service ID, template ID, public key. And I'll tell you where to get these IDs. Okay, go to emailjs just create a new account in my case I already created a free account you can go to pricing section and you can see what are the things available for free for free we have a monthly 200 email we can send we can get with, with request up to 50 KB and we have a personal for nine dollars professional and business and create sign up and create a new account in my case I already created a new account I'll just sign in okay I think already signed in here you can see yeah, after signing in you get this window go to email service add a new service you can see I already created a new service here just add a new service I'll show you just click on this add a new service and you have base you have different uh, emails like we have a outlook account Yahoo for which service you need to create let me click on this Gmail in your case you may get a three options just enable all the option and uh, click on the connect button after clicking on the connect button you can see this service will get created you can you just need to do copy this service id just copy this service id go to code and remove this and paste it here similarly for template id you can see here we have a second option called email templates just create a new template in my case i already created a template i'll show you how it looks you can see this is the body every time I'll get this body from email and the message and this is the subject new message from name you can see whatever the name we are given given here you just copy this and that should be a same value in the code also you can see here the name is here username just remove this username and give it as from name similarly for email and the message is correct okay yeah 
you can gi you should give uh, the endpoint email to which email you should get all the emails i'm giving my email here and just click on the save there's no any changes to save okay and after that you just go to settings copy this template id and paste it here yeah and the third parameter form dot current don't uh, no need to change anything here it refers to the current form and the fourth option is your public key to get this public key you go to account in my case i don't want to show my public key that's why you just click on this account after clicking on this account you get public key you just copy that id and paste it in the code i copied the public key and i pasted it in the code and let's see how code works okay let me refresh it let me send name as youtube youtube at gmail.com and message as youtube or let me send like hi manjuna something okay and let me send this here we don't have any success message because we don't have any code to show that success message go to gmail just refresh it you can see we got a new mail showing that new message from youtube this is the tem template which we have provided in in the email templates if you want to change your template you can change this is subject new message from from email message similarly you can see new message from youtube from email hope this helps you thanks for watching please do share subscribe thank you bye